Hey everybody, so let's just jump right into the nervous system and we're going to talk immediately about just the fact that there are two different divisions of the nervous system. This will come into play in just a bit when we start talking about the different types of uh, neuroglial cells and where they're located and what they do. So before we get there, we got to first just talk about the fact that there are two major divisions of the nervous system. These are the central nervous system and peripheral nervous system. CNS, PNS. These are just different ways that you're going to start seeing these throughout the next few slides. So the central nervous system is going to include the brain and the spinal cord. So the central, right down the middle. And then the peripheral nervous system is everything else. So these are the nerves that are going to be leading to and from the central nervous system. From there, we can talk a little bit about the peripheral nervous system. There are going to be 43 pairs of neurons that are going to come from the uh, peripheral nervous system. And these are going to include the 12 pairs of cranial nerves and the 31 pairs of spinal nerves. One of the really important things to keep in mind when we're talking about the peripheral nervous system is sensory integration and response. So everything needs to come through the peripheral nervous system in order to get to the central nervous system where we can integrate and then come up with a response. And then the response will be the motor output from the peripheral nervous system. Another way of seeing that is the image here that we already discussed in a previous video. So it's just the neural pathway. So it's a little bit weird to look at because it goes right to the spinal cord instead of the brain. But here's the idea. Your skin, peripheral nervous system, right? You're going to get sensory input. So you're going to feel a sense. This can be any of your five senses, right? You're going to see something, smell something, taste something, whatever, any of the five senses. In this case, it's skin, you're going to touch something. You're going to have a sense, right? It's going to send that sensory signal down the afferent pathway. That's the name of the pathway from the sensory area to the central nervous system. In this case, it goes to the spinal cord. From here, the signal is going to get sent up the spinal cord into the brain. It's going to be integrated. Your brain's going to decide on what to do. It's going to signal back down the spinal cord and eventually to wherever the motor output will occur. This is the efferent pathway, and it's going to lead to, in this case, a muscle doing something. Example, if I put my hand on a hot stove, right, I'm going to sense the heat. That heat sense is going to get sent up my afferent nerve to the spinal cord. Depending on how hot it is, if it's really hot, you may have a reflex, which we'll talk about later. But in this case, it'll get sent to the brain. The brain's going to say, hey, that's pretty hot. Move your hand. That signal's going to come from the brain down the spinal cord and then to the appropriate muscles via the efferent nervous system or uh, pathway and to the muscles. And those muscles are going to contract so that you move your hand off of that hot area. Or maybe it sends it to your legs so you walk away. Either way, the motor output could be going to multiple locations. Anyways, back to where we were. How are they all included? Central nervous system is brain and spinal cord, whereas the peripheral nervous system is everything else that connects to the central nervous system. They need one another, right? Everything, basically everything is going to go between these two systems, whether it be sensory or matter, motor output. But at the end of the day, whether or not you decide to do or not to do something, it needs to be processed via the central nervous system first. So with that said, if you have any questions, please let me know. We're going to start going into this in a little more detail now.